Yeah, um, I need to see the real data, but yeah. uh, the breakdown. But uh, the little I've seen so far, the single family permits are at least up a little bit. So there's one piece of half decent news in there. I don't think you've focused too much on the starts data, given you know we've just had a hurricane pass through the Carolinas. That's probably distorted some of the data there. That being said, when you look at the bigger picture, right. it doesn't look great on the housing side. It's, it's remarkable well, at this point in the cycle. Exactly. Why is that? We hear again and again how strong the economy is, GDP growth, unemployment, indicator after indicator, and yet housing seems soft. What, yeah, what would account for that? And autos. Well, I think the tax reform elements were a major giveaway for the corporate sector, the supply side of the economy. Uh, on the other side, you know, the impact, particularly on the salt side of things, the state and local tax deductions, I think has had a major impact on the housing mm. side of things. Um, I would have said, you know, looking at this maybe a year ago, that housing was in maybe the fifth innings of a nine innings baseball game, as it were. Um, you know, it, it's looking quite mature here. I'm very surprised. I think there's ultimately going to be a pickup again, uh, but maybe we're probably going to have to wait for it, maybe six months' time, maybe a year even. Can we continue? So this is very unfortunate for the U.S. housing market, and if you are a international viewer, I'm sure there's uh, plenty of other housing markets that are cooling down due to... Uh, the interest rates and for the US uh, I personally see this where um, all the taxes were basically given to property owners who rent the property not live in the property so for me as a real estate investor um, the tax deductions were great uh, there was nothing negative but if you're someone who buys a property and inhabits that property uh, you've gotten killed on your tax deductions which is unfortunate and uh, I mean we all kind of know that the the Trump tax breaks was a giveaway to corporations and business owners. And if you're not in that category, uh, you're going to suffer. And that's another reason why housing prices are going to continue to cool down and possibly decline because uh, it makes less and less sense to be an owner and uh, live in your property. It does make sense to be an investor and to rent your property to people that want to rent your property. But uh, let me know your thoughts on this, and we'll continue to cover the housing market along with crypto investments and uh, stock market investments, and I will talk to you guys soon.